What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Lego Fortnite. New Ninja Turtle skins are available in the item shop. If you would like to get them, please use creator code Zach Scott Games. That would really help me out. Uh, they even have April O'Neil. I'm Leonardo right now because I chose him for Lego because I, I got a sword here. But there aren't any size or nunchucks or staffs. Uh, so I went ahead and stuck with Leonardo. Uh, the skins look great. In regular Fortnite, you know, Battle Royale mode, but in, in LEGO they look amazing as well. Uh, so I went ahead and got them. Very cool. Very cool indeed. I am in my level 10 village in the Grasslands. Is that, is that what it's called? Grasslands, yes. And uh, one thing I forgot to do was to upgrade my crafting bench. Uh, I can do it if I have copper bars, obsidian slabs, and a brute scale. I think I have all that. So let's take a look. One of these chests has that stuff. Is it a brute scale? Yeah, so brute scale, copper bars. I might be, am I missing one? Do I need to like make one more? What's down here? No, there's some, no, that's regular copper. Obsidian slabs. I haven't turned them all into slabs yet. That's my bad. <laughs> I should have done that. Uh, but copper bars, let's, ooh, okay, copper bars and obsidian. How many do I need? Hold on, everyone's by the campfire having fun. Okay, shh, I'm trying to do this. Copper bar, obsidian slabs, 25. I need one more copper bar. That's not too bad. And then I need to make the obsidian slab. Is this where you make the copper bar? Yeah, let's make... Uh, I need two bright stone to do that. Uh, Do I have bright stone? I do. Oh, wait, that's bright core. Is that what I need? Bright core? Yeah, okay, cool. We're making one more. And then we need to smelt, like, a ton more obsidian... Uh, slabs unfortunately so uh let's just do this and honestly i think i'm just gonna hang back for a second and when this is done it'll be done and i'll do the upgrade all right guys i have what it takes uh let's go ahead and do this upgrade the copper bar 15 obsidian slab 25 and brute scale one upgrade let's see it what happens when it happens is he doing it? There you go. Whoa, that's cool. So, new recipes have showed up. Can I, I can't upgrade it anymore. It's maxed out. But I have the forest axe, which is three copper bars. and not, That's actually pretty good. Uh, the pickaxe, uh, which is obsidian slabs and a frost pine rod. And now I'm wondering, like, uh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This, though. Do we not have any more swords? Oh, this one's a little bit. This is copper bars only. 12 copper bars. For this long sword, pretty cool. I don't really use shields, but uh, you know these 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 charms are, are going to be good to get as well. Uh, the grappler glider, interesting. So I guess what I want to do is uh, get some of these purples here. This a purple pickaxe would be really cool uh, because I'm not really sure you know what we're going to run into, and then of course just getting a long sword. 12 copper bars for a longsword should work out pretty well. Uh, and then a new... This crossbow I already, ha I already have. Uh, that's not hard to get. Um, so yeah, let's make some of that stuff then. So copper bars. 12 copper bars. I think I, I don't think I have copper bars, but... Um, <laughs> let's combine those. And then I have some bright core. Not a lot of bright core, honestly. I may not have enough bright core, if we're just being honest. Uh, let's see... See what I can do over here. Have you? Are you finished your, with your job yet? No, he's still working. He takes forever. Um, let's make some copper bars then. I can't make very many. Uh, I need more bright core. So yeah, we're not really that close at all to getting copper bars. <laughs> oh, that doesn't help. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Remove all. How many can I make? Let's see. Okay, that's not enough. So, that's going to be worked on for copper bars. And what, what else do I need? Uh, for the forest axe, I need copper bars. For the pickaxe, I need obsidian slabs and, oh, frost pine rods. So, see, I don't even have frost pine. So, it seems like I'm going to be making a journey into the cold. It's just right over there. I mean, by right over there, I mean it is over there a, a bit. And so, let's just go over that way. I don't know what I'll need. I feel like I do need another pickaxe, though. I just can't get the one I really want. And so, you know, maybe I'll get a blue. You never know what, what I'm going to run into. Am I hungry again? 
sand claws. So I just need to make three more sand claws. I can make another blue one. Uh, so let's do that really quick. Hop over there and make one of, the, of these. And then we can make a blue one. And then do I want um, a blue for I need cut amber. I don't think I need it yet. And for as far as swords go, I could maybe go with the regular long sword, just not root. Sure. It's another one, just in case things get out of hand. So, um, this is about where I'm at right now. And um, am I hungry? Okay, let's eat this really quick. You know, I'm thinking it'll be cold when I get over there, and it probably will be. Um, here's the, the challenge, though. If I have... Uh, what a charm blue health charm inner fire uh increases resistance to cold temperatures to make a blue one you know i kind of need a lot of stuff bright core blast core cut ruby don't really have that but if i go with like an inner fire they don't even have like an inner fire charm i'm worried that well i'll get over there we'll see what happens it's probably gonna freeze me to go this way it really is but I feel like I really got to check it out because this is the next the next level here. Uh, so let's head out this way. We might find some new things. I might also be bringing too many things with me. Like I don't really want to bring copper. Because if I get out here and like suddenly I die and I have to track all the way back. You know what I'm saying? So let's just go take it easy a little bit. Let's drop off some of my more valuable things right here. Sitting in slabs too. Don't, don't even worry about them. Uh, and then... Uh, let's put in, sure, feathers, sand claws. Sure, wooden, yeah, this is probably good. Flex wood, flex wood rods. I really don't know what, I, what, what I'll need, so. Just kind of bring this stuff in with me. Bones, I'll probably pick up anyway. I'm afraid that the enemies are going to be, like, really strong out here. Meowsles is going to want to come with me, then. That's true, Meowsles is going to want to come. So, uh, quit your job. How is it going, by the way? 56 done, well, look. I'm, I'm sorry, you're gonna have to quit the job. You're gonna have to, uh, let's talk jobs, let's explore. Coming with me? He's coming with me. Now I might end up giving him my sword. And uh, so let me see, take this. My long sword, is it this one? I don't even know which one I'm giving him. I gave him the good one, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Can I do a take back? Like, hey, give that back to me. So I'm a Ninja Turtle, isn't that awesome? I think it's pretty cool. Get another meat really quick. And then we are off. Now, this looks like a trail to me. Does it not look like a trail to you guys? Now, is this on the map as a trail? Maybe that's what this part is? I don't really know. No, I'm on the trail right now. No, it's not on the map. Okay, so if we want to just... I mean, I see the white. It's just over this way. And then eventually I'll be building a base that way. I, I've seen what the bases look, look like. They look really cool. Oh, wow. There's something right there. Hold on. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, we're, we're actually really close. Hop. Ow. You just thought you could do that to me. And you thought you got away, chicken. No, you didn't. <laughs> All right. I'm a good guy. I'm cold. See, that's what I'm worried about, is getting over into this area and just being too cold for me. I can't seem to uh, craft anything. Even though I have a torch, you would think the torch would be enough, but it's not. Oh, wow, I'm actually really cold. This is a, a snowberry shake. This is actually exactly what I needed. And wh why, not? why not bring these with me? Why not? Let's, let's drink this. Let's t get 10 minutes of me not being cold anymore. I think is what it did, right? What did I do with my meat? Did I put it back in here? No, it's, I'm so cold. Oh, well. Oh, well, let's just... Okay. I, man, really? That shake didn't do a, do a trick. I don't know what to say. Other than we just have to brave the cold, you know? We can't just be... Maybe we'll find another shake that's, that's equally good. Maybe I'll be fine and be able to heal over time, so it won't really matter that I'm taking damage from the cold. Uh, here's another building here.
Whoa. Get him, Yousels. Ow. Right? You don't have to, I guess. These chests are really cool. Uh, I'll take some arrows. I am cold. I know. I'm sorry. We're not even in the area yet that I want to be. Oh, what are these blue plants? Snowberries. I think I have snowberries at home. Uh, so I already see like another brute. I bet it's even stronger than ever before. Just because of the fact that it's a brute in a new biome that I haven't even been to. And that makes me nervous. There's like a town over there, maybe? Scorpions. Are these scorpions? Even? Oh, now, surely these are going to be some sort of an issue. Whoa. So, I just saw that he died. Oh my gosh, that is so brutal. Are you joking, kidding me right now? Whoa! No way! Ah. Oh. Dude, he crashed through the rock to get me. Um, okay, well, so I just really need frost pine. <laughs> Holy, no. Oh, no, I'm way over here in my other town. No, <laughs> that's such a long walk. And I don't have anything. Oh, no. Hey, there you are. That is such a long walk. Oh, my goodness. Um, man, I'm so mad I didn't put the bed in the place. What do you have for me? Hello, I don't have anything. How's your job? Give me the plank and that. I don't know, dude. I don't have anything. How's your job? Not root plank. Thanks. How much stuff did I get? 20, I guess, so. Oh my goodness. Can I just make something, really? I can't make anything. I can make a short sword. I don't need a short sword, honestly. <laughs> this is awful. What did I leave in these chests? Some cool stuff. Maybe some slurp juice I'll take with me. Me? Oh, a long sword. That's actually better than I, I had hoped for, honestly. All right, let's go. I hate the I hate that to walk so far, but let's go. All right, so I just saved my spot in bed. Now it's time to go get my stuff. And uh, my stuff is over here, so not too far in. Let me just go get it and not get destroyed. And if I do get destroyed, at least my respawn will be a little bit closer. So that was not fun. That guy was really tough. It took out Meowsles in like one hit. It took out me in two. I might need to start carrying a shield or something or just kind of beef up my defense a little bit more, see what I can get. Uh, but surely we need uh, something here. And I, I do want to see if I can find the trees that give me that particular wood because I think that will unlock some more possibilities for me. Uh, is it the snowy trees? Is that what we do? I don't even know for sure. I'm cold. Yes, 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 indeed. I am cold. All right. Uh, let me. I, I think the first order of business is just to go get the backpack. So, let's see what we got. And being cold, I think, just means that I'm slower here, too, by the way. It feels like I'm slower. It feels like I can't move as easily. Could be wrong, I suppose, but that's how it feels. No, these these wolves are the same, right? These wolves are not a big deal. Meowsles, get them. I'm in here now. Good job. Did I, did I even look up here? I did, didn't I? Yeah. But I looked in here. I guess I didn't find this stuff, though. So, here we go. My backpack just over there. Let's go get it. Let's chop down some snowy-looking lumber, see if that helps. Oh, man. Okay, so the great news is, sure, this is back. What in the world is happening? Okay, so, what's on the ground? So, obviously, I have some stuff that I can probably use. Uh, let's see. Sorry. Uh, trying to reorganize on the fly here. Maybe don't need the one feather. Maybe uh, put these in my backhand. And what is this? This is, oh, yeah, snowberries. 
So me being cold at the moment is definitely a thing, but uh, let's ditch these mushrooms. I, I don't really feel like I need those mushrooms. Let's use this sword instead. Uh, snowberries might even be good. Can I just eat one right now? Will they protect me? They don't protect me enough is the thing. All right, and then I wanted to check this place out over here. Nothing in there. Okay, let's just get to work. Let's see what I can find. Uh, oh. Of course, of course. Now this is probably just regular wood. But this stuff here is the good stuff that I, I need a better axe for. And so... Uh, why didn't I think this through? I got, my, I got my backpack. Let's go back to town. Okay, well, here I am. Uh, I don't even know what to do with my inventory at the moment. I guess I could put a couple things up. Uh, but here I am. Uh, that goes there, sure. And then everything else is looking pretty good, I suppose. The only thing I'm confused on is, like, where do I put the bones and the spider web? Spider web stuff goes over here. Right? Right there? Yeah, there we go. Okay. To get an upgrade, uh, to get an upgraded axe. So I was using this uh, forest axe here that was blue. Not good enough for that wood, right? So if I want, I need copper bars. Three copper bars. I actually have those, thankfully. Thankfully I have those. Because I was making those, okay, great. But obviously I'm, I'm at about at a point where it's like I'm gonna need to start getting more, you know, of those bright cores and whatnot. But the good news is I will be able to upgrade my axe. And uh, so if I take a look here, I can make this forest axe. I think it's going to be great. Just craft that. Put it in there, pal. All this other stuff is wonderful. Um, maybe for things that are not, you know. I, but hey, if I can get the... Uh, do you think I can get the essence table up for, for this? Like uh, Durability damage is okay. Durability would be really good. Does it already have a dirt? What am I looking at? I think I was not, okay, rough amber, granite slabs, okay. Let's see how much rough amber I have. I have enough, this is great news. So let's put these back. Rough amber, granite slabs might be a little bit, you know. Sorry, I'm still, still sorting things for a second here. Uh, all right, rough amber, how many granite slabs do I have? Let me put some wood stuff away really quick. These are nice to have, but I mean, like, I don't need to hold on to them right now. Maybe not. Wood, just in general, goes here. Wood planks, sure. All, all this stuff needs to be bigger. Granite slabs. Uh, I probably don't have any. Let me just make some granite slabs here, then. And then, uh, deposit. Let's just make, like, 30 granite slabs, because we don't know what we're going to be doing with them all. But I have this axe and uh, I'm gonna want to do durability. And if you take a look, I'm probably not gonna wanna do health uh, in, of enemies dropping healing items when using weapons and tools. I'm not gonna be attacking enemies with this. Durability is really all I need. Damage, uh, now, I don't know. I don't, I, don't, I don't really have those things. But durability I will have. Uh, so I can go ahead and make, uh, you know, there you go. There's one durability. I might want to just do durability all the way throughout. Like three levels of durability. And I can do that as soon as I get more granite slabs. They're working on that. Let me think about how I'm going to organize everything really quick. Let me think about... Because uh, if you take a look, you know, I have these uh, raw berries and stuff. Flour, meat, all these raw foods that I think go great in here. And then... Um, I have wolf claws that can go away, probably. And then over here, there are like potions and stuff. Now these snowberry shakes seem to do okay in the cold. Might bring them with me, maybe, I don't know why. Maybe makes sense. And then furthermore, this rough amber can probably go away soon. Um, I think we're in a good spot. I think we're gonna spot, whoa, it's suddenly dark? What the heck? 
What was that about? This is like suddenly dark. Okay. I need to... All these things need better chests. Bigger chests, in fact. And if you take a look at what we can build in terms of the chests, you know, uh, it's not that we're limited. It's just that there might be even more stuff. But this gold, this is iron bar and frost pine. I don't have either one of those for the grand chest. 24 items sounds great. Obsidian slabs and copper bars. Seems like quite a lot for just that. I mean, they all seem like quite a lot, right? But grand chests will be kind of what's next. For now, these are going to have to do. And in fact, uh, I might have, an, I might just need to make an overflow pile or something. It's like, like, here are some extra bones that I don't need. Extra wood planks that I don't need at the moment, but we'll probably eventually need anyway. Um, wood and granite, I think, can kind of go side by side. This flex wood stuff. Could be good just to keep in here, but I don't really... Like I said, this kind of stuff can go in the overflow. I don't know. Oh, man. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. Drop in the flex wood. And then just think about this overflow business here. This is my overflow chest, I guess. For the moment. And then now that these are done, take. And then I can definitely do another essence of durability. I think I just want three essences of durability. This is the best axe that I have at the moment. It could have probably get better, but I mean, for a while, it's going to be like this. And rough amber and granite slab, honestly, aren't that hard to come across, apparently. So, let's just wait for another, like, five of those. Bones, you know, I could have, I could put bones away in that chest again. I don't know. Overflow bones, sure. Amber, granite slabs, we're working on it. We, I mean, granite and granite slabs, we're, we're working on it. These swords obviously leave a lot to be desired. Um, to get more better swords, which I will, will honestly will probably need while I'm there, like the long sword copper bar, is where it's at. Twelve. It's gonna take a lot to make those. Not really though, because I have the copper. So I have the copper, right? Twelve copper bars. Yeah. Okay. So just we'll throw in like a you know ten of these, I suppose, and then we'll have enough for that next sword. Which is pretty cool, but I need to... It's not, not even this. Oh, but to make... Ah, oh, that's right. That's the... Ah, I forgot all about that. I forgot all about that. I need Bright Core. So Bright Core is keeping me from having another sword. And then... Let's just toss these things away really quick. Um, Rough Amber. Probably don't need to hold on to that right now. Wait, did I need Rough Amber for this? I did. What am I thinking? The processes I go through. All right, this thing is gonna be super durable. Like, we're not gonna be, this is gonna be the ultimate, like, ax, for real, for me, the forest ax. So great. Um, you know, essence of damage, I don't really have the blast core stuff, so. This, this ax is where it's at. Um, I'm happy with it, obviously. And then, uh, let me eat something else really quick. Now, going out for more, you know, what was I thinking about with the shields, for example? Because I could maybe make a knight shield. I need copper bar for that. Uh, for this, I just need flexwood, rod, and cord, which is possible, but, you know, regeneration charm. So much stuff to do, so much stuff to make, when really all I need is... If I want to start making like this pickaxe, I need like frost pine rods. So I need to go get frost pine. I need to go, you know, set out and make a village over there probably. Or something. Uh, but I also could use, for adventuring that way, I, I could also use more copper bars, which means more, uh, which honestly means more of everything. This uh, bow and arrow, this is like the best one I have at the moment. Flexwood rod, drawstring, easy to make. The recurve crossbow, could probably just make one of those really quick. So I, I had them. Flexwood rod, and it was drawstring. Let's make one really quick. I'll take it with me. I almost wonder, you know, what I could do with it. But this seems as good as it gets for the moment. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. What are you guys talking about? What do, what do you have? How's your job? 
fried egg, corn on the cob, grilled meat. How about you? How's your job? Silk thread, heavy wool thread. And then Mouse has been, Mousicles has been accompanying me. Aura's here. How's he doing? How's he doing? Lots of stuff, for sure, for sure. And then drop off um, some eggs over. Well, these are cooked eggs, so drop off the cooked stuff over here. Uh, eggs, corn, then silk, thread, all that stuff. We'll go over here. So, okay, we're gonna go back in now that it's almost daytime. I was just like kind of wasting time, basically, waiting for time to pass. We drop off some cordage in here, drawstring in here. We are do doing pretty good, I would say. But extra bones go in here. Um, extra rods could go in here. The other rods seem to be fine. So yeah, what's really holding me back is if I want this pickaxe, I need frost pine rods. I might have enough obsidian, which would be good because really I need. Uh, but that next pickaxe would be really good. This is almost done. So obsidian slabs. Let me just make more obsidian slabs while we're gone. I have five. I can make 14 more. Let's just make them. Right? So I need obsidian slabs, frost pine rods. So. We are now on an adventure to get more frost pine, uh, or to get frost pine at all. And then the main thing, maybe I may not have a recipe for the rods. That could be it. But the other thing I'm kind of worried about in general is just dealing with these enemies. I, I do not feel strong enough. I'm gonna need more of that bright core or whatever it was so I can make more copper bars. Because the copper bar seems like a big setback for me. Hey now. Hey now. Because that guy just rolled over me big time and it was painful and I didn't like it, so. And then I also need some stuff. What's going on over here? There's okay, so there's a regular beast dude over here, right? Like, like this one's just the standard one. I want to see if I can fight him. Ten. Ten. Run. All right, great. A wolf here. A wolf here. He died. Oh, shoot. Shoot. Meowsles, get him. Oh, shoot. Oh, wow. Uh, this is a little bit much. I don't know where that was. I mean, this isn't so bad. Get out of here, dude. The mouse is okay. Answer is probably not. But this takes a lot of arrows. Oh, shoot. In fact, I'm, I'm getting low on arrows for sure. But this is the first time I've ever fought one of these guys. How much HP does he have? Is Meowsel even going to help with anything? Oh, I got him. I got him. There you go. And down here is a brute scale. All right, great. So I beat a regular brute. Took a ton of arrows, of course. Uh, but that seems pretty good. And I'm impressed with myself. I mean, can't brag too much, but I am impressed. Oh, shoot. Which is this? Which one's this one? This is just a regular one, right? Yeah. All right. If we're going to go in the cold, we seem to be doing. I brought one of these drinks. Let me drink one really quick. There you go, sure. Down to 19 of these. I'm gonna need more arrows very soon. I just need to figure out what, what has, you know. 
Those are just vines. Wow. Is this it? This is frost pine, my dude. Some of it's also regular, but we got the we actually got the recipe for the rods then. That's great news. The stuff is a lot stronger, you know. Excellent, and it glows like a purple, so that's a really cool feature. This is the most durable axe that I can have at the moment. And the fact that I'm here kind of at the beginning, to me, says a lot. But I want to get that pickaxe next. Because if I can get the pickaxe, and I can also, you know, with, with granite slabs or whatever, maybe also get uh, another super durable pickaxe. That would be super awesome. This one does take a while to chop down. Goodness. I don't have another one of these axes. At least they made it feel a lot more difficult because if this were just super easy to chop down, but I had to just use a different, you know, wood. So I have a stack of these frost pines. I'd like to bring maybe three stacks home. That would make sense to me, right? Then if we find anything else, to mine, I'll I can go back home and get the pickaxe and whatnot. Could work. So we're looking for like 90 total of this uh, frost pine stuff, and then make it, and then also make the granite slabs, and then I'll be a mining machine. I just won't be a fighting machine. That will be the disappointing part. I'll be kind of weak otherwise. But still, mining and resource gathering looking pretty good. Looking pretty solid. Alright, so let me just keep doing this. And uh, then I'll go back to town once I have a good stack. Okay, I see a person over there. I'm going to go check him out really quick after I'm done with this. I just, I'm curious what he is. I'm almost done mining uh, all of these things. There's a bigger one. But I'm curious if he's going to be like super strong or what. So I actually have done a lot this episode. I found a new biome. I've been... Uh... Here. I, I beat a brute. Oh, he's just... That was a one hit, dude. Surprise! This looks like the basic area. This is, yeah, this isn't anything special. I'm glad I got some of that stuff, though. Seeds don't really interest me at all anymore, honestly, if I'm being truthful. What is this? What is this? Oh, there's just vines and whatnot. All right, it says I'm cold. Still working. I'm almost, I almost got my third stack, so. Sorry, mousicles, mousels, whatever. I don't have what it takes I just don't I got three stacks though let's go back home all right let's just kind of hop right in the lumber mill I have the frost pine thing change the recipe and then uh, seriously gonna turn like 60 of these 30 of these <laughs> into frost pine rods I know I'm hungry I know I know well were there any other ingredients uh, because once I get those rods, Peely's back. I really want to invite him to my town. Peely, you want to stay here? Uh, live in my village. Yes. Alright, so I actually had a bed for him. Great. Uh, this seems to be done as well. Take those, and then once I get the frost pine, we're looking at, uh, being able to make this pickaxe. Just need five of those rods, and we'll be able to make a pickaxe. That's great. Five rods. Take once more a new item. There you go. Craft it. And I would love, again, especially to make it super durable. So, oh, I don't have the room for that. Okay, let's ditch this one. 
And then uh, grab this new one. So now I have two purples. And then if we're looking at um, essence of durability, we need more granite slabs. But I can at least apply one of the essences. And then I just need to make a bunch more granite slabs. And then we'll be able to uh, uh, walk away with that. And then I might be ready to... I mean, I don't know what else I need to do there, but maybe maybe start making a town. I don't even know. Yeah, Peely, why don't you go do something here? Uh, let's talk jobs. Help the village. What about a resource job? Collect nearby resources? Sure. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, dude. If you have any suggestions in the comments, please let me know like what I should be working on with this guy. Because sometimes I just I literally don't know. Uh, granite. Yeah, I'm just gonna drop in, make a bunch more granite slabs. Change the recipes. There you go. And then, uh, once that's done, well, you know what we'll do. Alright, back in the Frostlands. It does slow me down when I get here. It seems to be raining. Uh, so I got my, my, my pickaxe and my regular axe. How did I miss that? Come on. Thank you. Uh, so I could actually uh, drink this really quick. There you go. Now, uh, I mean, hmm. The thing is, I can make a town here. Like, I don't even have to go too far into it. I can just make a town here, and that town would be really close to my other town. And so that could be a goal, but I think I'm just going to... Um, Maybe start the town process next episode. Maybe I I want to venture off a little bit. For oh, there's a spider. Hold on. That was a good hit. Now this spider also gives me just regular silk, but it seems like more silk than usual. What I want to do is I want to venture off. I want to see what I can find here. Um, I kind of want to trace the edge. Yeah, there's a brute over there. There's probably no way. I'll be able to beat the brute. <laughs> like, like I can't, I can't even think of a way. Like, I'm thinking of it in my head. I'm like, there's no way. Hold, but that's okay. This awesome chest thing is here. Yeah, we don't need those things at the moment. Is it storming now? I kind of want to go... Um, part of me wants to just be like, well, I'll just make my town where there's a cave. You know, but there, that may not be the case. And I kind of want to go along the outskirts of here. Oh, shoot. No, 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 Oh, my God. What do I do? This I, I know the arrows are not good against this guy. Oh, that was not bad. Hold on. Wait, wait. Wait, was, which guy was this? Was this guy just a right? That's just a regular shell. But I guess we stepped into the grassland. That was a grasslands one right there. And like I said, I am on the kind of the edge here of the grasslands and the frostlands. If you look, the moment I'm in the frostlands. So that's pretty cool. I don't remember if I've been over here. Uh, I think I did go over here. It can't be good for my sword. Uh, yeah, there are a lot of snow berries and whatnot. There's a sheep up here. Uh, you still have a sword, right? Do you not have a sword at all anymore? These sheep look like normal sheep. Oh, wow. Hold on. Now, these guys have blast... Powder. What was that sound it made? Now, this just seems like regular stuff here, doesn't it? Interesting. So, this seems just like a regular thing that I was here for. Um, okay, but... Yeah, still cold. I'm genuinely curious, you know, like, how far this stuff goes. Um, if I really get deep into it, I might consider making a base. Not necessarily a town, but just a bed somewhere in a building. 
But I'm, I'm super interested in, in where like these biomes end up going because I'm just kind of tracing it like the edge of this here without going too far in. Eventually we will have to go far in, I imagine. That's, a, that's another ice spider. He doesn't even have a sword anymore. Such a shame. I hear a dog. It's like a regular one, right? Oh jeez, which one which one's this? Which one's this? That's an ice one. This is the guy who totally whooped me earlier. And it just totally killed him just then. Oh boy. Let me get up here. What do I do? Like what's the what's the goal? Can he get up here? He's picking on me. Heavy wool. Probably isn't so bad. Is he... How is he against arrows again? What the heck? Dude, no way. Okay, that almost killed me again. Let's just eat really quick while I have the chance. This guy is tough. I wish... It sucks. Okay, that chest is no big deal. I, I really don't like this guy. There's no way this wolf is going to win that, this fight. Man. He keeps hiding from my arrows. Oh, dear. Ugh. Right, that missed me, probably. Do I have anything on me that could be used? Like... He's so annoyingly tough. Oh, if I knew his patterns, it would be a little easier. I'm so cold. Did, did he disappear? Yeah, go go back and fight this guy. I can't protect you, sheep. I'm fighting a much more dangerous foe than this wolf guy. Good job, good job. Oh God, not again! No, help me! Wow, that's a spot on hit. Oh no! Get this guy out of here. He can't reach me here, can he? I'm eating. I'm eating as much as I can, dude. Hurry up and eat. It's for your health. All right, I'm gonna see if I can just drop on him in a second. Oh, I'm here! Shoot, dude! Ow! I'm dead. No, he's dead. Thank goodness, he's dead. Wow. Oh boy, that was so scary. I actually got him. You were no help. <laughs> oh wow. Okay, so that, I mean the enemies here are hard for sure. And but I got a frost shell, which is really cool. I now have one frost shell. <laughs> oh no, there's another one. We got we got to avoid those guys. There's no way. There's just no way. Um, all right, so this is still like this is like the transition of the biome here, right? So, like, technically, yeah, we're still in the frost, but it's you know, we're getting closer to the other type. Oops, I missed. Not a big deal. Oh, shoot, these guys look hard. Oh, wow, yep, these guys are hard. I got one. Hold on. I'm, I'm using so many arrows. Hold up. This is a good sword. You have an axe. I have that axe. Oof. That's not the right axe. What is this? Bread? Great, great. 
Th these are the first like really really hard humanoids I've fought against. All right, and he has a uh, a crossbow, uh, but none of them are great. Interesting. And this is just a f oh, this is a forest axe. Man, okay. Yeah, so uh, this place is wicked. I'm using so much of this bow and the, the subsequent arrows that I have. Um, oh, wait, my inventory is totally full. Okay, because I picked up bread or something, right? Let's get rid of some of the stuff I probably don't need, like bones, raw meat. And then, you know, we might just be in a position where it's like, well, okay, we're about done with the episode. This, this is, this is treacherous. But we need, I feel like we still need to explore a little bit more. In here. Yeah, I'm disappointed in the rewards that we're getting, though. Let's be real. I'm also disappointed that Meow Souls isn't really that strong. <laughs> Can't really protect me. There we go, another one. This one, yeah, these items are just not good. All right, uh, what was what was I looking at? Now there's this up here, which is interesting as well. This is in the grasslands. So these guys probably aren't difficult. Now these guys are going down in one hit. All right, and then this chest is yeah. Nothing to really care about. I don't need this. Alright. It's dark. That's not good for me. At all. But I could see, you know, maybe making a bed. Maybe getting a, a, a safe spot. So in case I were to die around here, then I could easily come back. Putting a bed in a, in a room like this probably isn't a big deal. Uh, I'm really cold, though. Uh, wow. Uh, let me just sit in bed. This is my bed. I'm just sitting in here. Am I taking damage while in bed? I don't know. I'm healing a little bit. This would be a good place to spend the night. It's so, so bad for me. Uh, this is, it's so cold at night. It's ridiculously cold at night. Hold on. There we go. I put that in. That just doesn't ha help. So yeah, I'm gonna probably, the bed's fine. But I need to return home. Ow. Yeah, I'm gonna go back into the grasslands where it's not so cold. There we go. Just like step a little bit away as you're in the grasslands. It's not as cold. So, there's even a fire over here. Seems like there's people over here. <laughs> uh, so, um, you know, with that said, I think next episode I will be looking to... Uh, maybe establish a base in the area. Do I feel bad about this? I don't know. Maybe. Hey, you guys are fighting skeletons? I'm fighting you. Good for me. All right. <laughs> oh, man. So, um... Man, I really do want to explore deeper, but I feel like before I really set out and explore, like, like, and I mean it, like, I probably need to get more blast, uh, core or whatever, whatever that was from that, from the other biome, and so that would make sense for me to return home then, probably reset my bed, then maybe make it my way all the way back, uh, because home's here, and then the next, you know, biomes there it would be so cool to find like if this if all three biomes like met at like a triangle like they all three touched that would be really cool to make like a giant mega city on uh just travel between place to place have access to all the biomes not to worry too much can i roll this down at these guys <laughs> it did hit him but it was just wasn't the best all right so, with that said, that's going to be my plan. I do thank you all for watching Ninja, Ninja Turtle Skins Rule. Uh, come back next time for more, and I'll probably go deeper into this biome, but it's just so scary right now. Uh, maybe even make a town as soon as I can. But thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye. 
I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.